Okay, next mission. <clears throat> you did a great job learning the basics. Listen, I got a special lesson lined up. Your first water landing and a party. Ooh. I need a ride out to a friend's wedding. It's out in the bay on a yacht. They've already set sail, so the only way to get out there is in the Icon. Take a look around this cockpit. Simple, huh? Almost like a car. Look around by holding the right mouse button while dragging. Ah, that's now cool. center your view. Fancy schmancy. Not too shabby. Very nice. Very, very, very nice. When you're ready, just push the throttle forward for takeoff. Four. Lift the nose to take off. That was easy. Now we're flying. Go ahead and raise the landing gear. Climb straight out to 500 feet. Good, now throttle back to 5500 RPM or about 90% and maintain this altitude. Now turn to a heading of 340. You can see our heading change on the display on the top of the screen and on the GPS in the cockpit. Three forty area. All right, we're on course. Just keep flying at this heading, and we should see the yacht along the coast. <laughs> the wedding yacht. Currently, you're in cockpit view. This view enables you to manipulate the controls in the cockpit. Why don't you check out the various other views while we have a little time? It's a great way to gain perspective. Cycle views F7, chase F8, cockpit F9, fly by F10, free look F11, top down F12. I like to fly by. Ever free look, that's what it is. F11. Free look allows you to easily look at your surroundings. And that would be F12. Top down view is helpful for finding your way around an airport. Nice. Oops. Don't want to do that. Okay, enough looking around. Let's get to the yacht. If you want to save some time, activate go. the skip to waypoint <clears throat> command. It'll take us right to the yacht. You'll see this command in most missions, and you can use it at any time when a skip is active. Hmm. That looks like the yacht we're heading to. Pull the throttle back as we descend, so we don't get going too fast. Fly past the yacht to set up for our landing. Do a low pass to make sure they see us. That'll let them know that they should stop the boat so we can land. Speed us up a little bit.
Great, it looks like they saw us. <laughs> I Head hope. north to put some room between us and the yacht. We'll need that space to land. Set up for landing. Keep going a little further. This is far enough. Turn around back toward the yacht. Alright. Okay, now we just need to gently descend and slow down to 60 knots for the landing. Bring the throttle back to 25% or 2500 RPM and use the elevator controls to adjust your speed. Raise the nose to slow down or lower the nose to speed up. Try to land about 100 feet from the boat. Not too close. We don't want to hit it. We should be under 60 knots before touching down. Throttle back to idle and let the aircraft settle onto the water. Nice touchdown. Nice. Congratulations on your first water landing. Woohoo! I'm going to bring us in close so we can get on the yacht without getting wet. Thanks for helping me get out to the wedding. <laughs> Coconut bra. <laughs> nice.